Hey everybody, Brian Akins, wandering around in the shop today and I thought, well, it ain't often you get four Confederate uniforms at one time. So I thought I'd show them off real quick. This is a uh, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful frock coat. Check out that original checkerboard lining. Has had some restoration. You can see that the uh, pocket was redone. Made no attempt to hide it. Inside the sleeves was redone. Uh, story I got was blood, sweat, and tears. They were about gone. But the restoration was professionally done with no attempt to hide it. All the uh, body has been also professionally redone. The collar was also just destroyed, basically, and they put his rank, the original rank, back on the new collar. Other than that, she is good to go, and she's ready for another 160 years. This one is on my website, Rebel Relics. It's been placed on hold. This one was brought home as a uh, Yankee War trophy. The Yankee actually had a plan to disguise himself as a uh, Confederate and try to sneak out, but the war ended, so he brought his, his war trophy little shell jacket home. Here's a Major's coat. This one's had no restoration other than a few holes, uh, little Malden holes, original buttons. And then lastly here, have another little frock coat. Have all the history on this one. It was actually made in Georgia, worn by a Georgia soldier. His name is T.J. Martin. And you can see the uh, Confederate A buttons on there. This one is also on my website, Rebel Relics. Anyway, guys, just want to show off. This ain't every day you got four beautiful, authentic Confederate coats in one place. Appreciate you guys. If you like the videos, hit subscribe. I have lots of antiques firearms. TikToker will not let me put them on TikTok. So check out my YouTube page also. Appreciate you.